everyone, so welcome back to my channel. This is Shu from Sky and Shu. So I just filmed a makeup haul from the stuff that I bought over the past month. And I bought quite some clothing too, it's a really so good I decided to piece and split this really video into basically around for good the haul. YT. And as you can see, I'm way too lazy so to, to change my shirt, so I just put on them are really, really transparent. Like, and this one day, is still a little bit really transparent, but it's nothing and I have too crazy. I have my last video that I am basically a shopaholic. And this video basically just proves that. And without further ado, let's just get started. And this is a bunch of stuff that I have bought for spring. And yeah, so let's get started. So I'm going to start out with shoes just because my name is Shoe on this channel. And I bought two pair of shoes for this upcoming spring season. And it was a bit weird because these shoes were on sale for ridiculously cheap. Which I guess they were last season style, but they fit perfectly for this spring. The first place I went to was called Spring. And they had really, really good deals. It was something like extra 40% off everything else sale or something like that. And I got these super cute Oxfords for $20. Isn't that amazing, guys? And they basically just look like this. And I think they're the cutest thing ever. Am I right? I think that they will just go well with so many different outfits. And I am so excited to wear them. And so I think that will definitely be a great stable for my wardrobe. Second thing I got is this pair of Toms. And I've been wanting to purchase a pair of Toms for so long, but I really didn't want to spend $55. I like the concept between behind the whole Tom thing about every pair of shoes that you buy, they donate a pair to someone who doesn't have shoes. But I mean, if I really want to be a good person, I would just donate that $55 to Africa instead of donating to buying this pair of shoes but anyways I still bought this pair of Toms when it was on sale and I think they're so awesome for the upcoming spring season guys they're super cute florals are they not I feel like this pair of Toms is a spring written over them I think they were $30 with tags which I think is just amazing 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 and I mean, how how adorable are these? They're just so, so cute for the upcoming spring and summer. But I heard Toms are super comfortable, so that's another bonus. And I got this pair of Toms in a shop called Stance. And I'm not sure if that shop is everywhere, but i definitely seen it in Ottawa. And if you live in Ottawa, you can check it out in Bayshore Mall. You basically just have to scavenge hunt for um, sales, but usually they occur around January to February. That's where I find all my great deals. And basically Zara had a really good deal as well. The entire store was on sale and everything was pretty cheap. So the first thing I got from Zara is basically this really cute plain t-shirt. And it is a little bit cropped, but it's a really cute v-neck that I think is just really easy to pair. It's $5.99. And I think there was extra sale on that, so something like $4, which is pretty great for a basic t-shirt. And the other thing I got was so cute, and it's basically just this really cute white t-shirt. Super oversized, which I think would be really cute to wear with a pair of leggings, or even if, or even just a pair of shorts and some knee-high socks or something like that. And I don't know, I think this would be really fun to style. I got it purposely on size medium just because I wanted to look that super oversized effortless look and on it is this fashion facts and it's this outfit of the day 100% shopping 100% and uh, red lips 100% and it's this ch chic 100% uh, what else does it say classy it's this classy 100% and jewels 100% as well as well as shoes 100% percent daily value are based on every day is a fashion show and the world is your own way and that cute guys and I think it's just a super adorable oversized t-shirt which I will definitely get a lot of use out of. Um, I'm, re I'm really excited to pair something like this. This is a super oversized tee. Um, I want it to look super chic but effortless and it is something that I think that will be a little bit of a fun challenge for me to try out. If you have a really cute shirt then obviously it's just really fun to throw it on and look like you didn't try at all and you look glamorous but if you have a wide t-shirt and you can make that work then you look really stand out because it's like wow that girl can pull off a white t-shirt super well and it's just a white t-shirt so I'm looking toward doing that challenge basically and thinking of a couple ways to style that so I'm kind of excited for that t-shirt and I spent way too much time talking about that one t-shirt. So let's move on. Hey guys, so I had to switch places because the sun is setting down. So it was like chasing after me. And I didn't notice that until I finished filming the whole video. 
And then I looked back to it and I saw there's this like weird light that was hitting the middle of my face. And I was like, whoa, what was going on? And it happened so that the sun was basically messing up my whole video. So I have to restart halfway. So I hope the clip before turned out all right. And I'm so sorry if there was like a bit of sunlight right here from the clips before. But I just really want to get this video out. So for that sake, I'm not going to restart the whole video. So let's do this because my battery is about to die out and I really want to get this done. Anyway, so I went to Forever 21. Oh crap, did I mess that up? Okay, so... Oh! Whoa. Okay, so basically I went to Forever 21 and they had really good sales. So it was something like buy one, get one free. So I really could not pass on that because the stuff was already on sale and on top of that, it was buy one, get one free. So I must say that the shopping was not a pleasant experience whatsoever. There was like clothes everywhere on the floor and there was way too much stuff to look at and you had to basically fight the crowd but for the price point and for the stuff that I got it was definitely worth it and I'm just gonna start off with my first trip there so every trip I only pick up two items because at that time I was trying to basically kind of save money and not go crazy on things the first thing I got is this really cute skirt I have basically seen this skirt on every YouTuber's channel and I think I saw this skirt on Daily Look before and they were selling this skirt for something like 40 bucks to 80 dollars I can't really remember the exact price but it was just way overpriced and I was like you are not worth that much and I am technically broke so I really shouldn't be spending money um, or at least that much for a skirt so I had to give that a pass I thank god I waited because this skirt is identical to that skirt I have never felt that skirt but this the quality of this skirt feels really thick and it feels really heavy duty and I whoa and I, it's really stretchy as well and I, it's just one of those things that if you look at it you imagine the skirt being from a really high-end brand or something like that just because I, it, it is so well made and just feels like really expensive material and this was $20 so buy one get one free I got another shirt for 20 I got another shirt free because I bought this so technically this was $10 so that is definitely worth it and this was originally $30 but I got it for 10 this is a really cute um easy to pair skirt it's black and white and at the back it has a zipper that goes down in gold which I think is a really pretty neutral color and it's going to be really fun and easy to pair with so many different tops for the summer so I really love that the free part of this trip is basically the sweater and the sweater is $20 so you kind of even out um, the price this is $18.99 that was $20.90 the sweater is basically just a red and white sweater and it actually kind of reminds me of Christmas which is not something that I'm a fan of but when I wear it it doesn't remind me that much of Christmas at all and it's really it just looks really really cute and it really does add a pop of color to the whole outfit and it has this like crochet detailing everywhere and like basically little holes all throughout the sweater so it's a really cute and fun sweater to basically just throw on when you don't feel like trying that hard for that day. So there's that. I went to Forever 21 the second round and the second round I picked up two things as well. So the first thing I picked up is this super super adorable top. So this top was $23, it used to be $33.80 but I did get a dress for free along with this top so I guess that evened it out to $11. And this shirt is just really really cute it's kind of a kimono style it's really loose fitting boho style and kimono style had a baby i feel like it would be this because um on the sleeves it have this like really cute beading pattern which reminds me of a complete like boho style kind of thing really flowy so that really reminds me of the kimono style so i really love this top and it's something I personally think would be really cute to just throw on, throw on on a day that you don't really feel like trying. Honestly, pairing this with leggings or just with like shorts or with pants and you are basically good to go and you will look super put together and I really do like this shirt. What can I say? So another thing I got is a really cute summery slash fall kind of item. I don't know what when I will wear this per se. Um, I would definitely wear this for the summer just because that it is floral color but I feel like it's more of a fall color just because it's kind of like those dark flory colors but regardless I think this is such a cute dress and basically it looks it, it is kind of a burgundy floral kind of color and um, 
it's really flowy. It kind of reminds me of the Brandy Melville kind of like dresses. And it does have a slip underneath which is good because I really don't like those clothing where it has no slip and the whole thing is just see-through and I'm just like, whoa, uh, I cannot pull that off unless I'm going to the beach full of hot guys anyway, it's definitely a really flowy top it doesn't cinch in or anything like that so I will probably be wearing a belt with this at the back, it has this like really cool stream pattern that goes on and I think this adds a little bit of something extra to the whole simple little dress so I really do like this dress and I think it's really really cool how at the back there is this like really cool cutout kind of thing and at the front it's just super simple and I can just imagine me wearing this with like a belt and a shitload of like jewelry and like necklace and everything and I think that'd be just something really cool to style with like some knee high boots um, or even just some knee high socks and a pair of oxford or anything like that I just I can see so many ways to dress this up and down which is something I love about a clothing piece so that sums up my Forever 21 part and the last store I went to was basically Urban Outfitters and I only picked up two things from Urban Outfitters and I actually picked up this one thing online but I love this cardigan so much so this is basically a poncho kind of cardigan and it's a tribal print so this is what it looks like it is super flowy the whole thing basically just drapes over you and it is super oversized as you can see I have to like raise this whole thing up when I wear this it just goes all the way down to my knees basically and um, I don't know I really do like this though I think that it looks super effortless and when I wear it it feels like I'm just wearing a blanket over me which is really amazing because I will be at work but I can just literally throw a blanket over me and feel like I'm at home so I love 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 this cardigan and it makes it look like I put in some effort to my whole outfit because it is so flowy and so cute and it really does add a really stable accent to my whole outfit um, but it feels like I'm wearing blankets so and this sweater was only $20 oh my god it feels so soft it feels so soft so we're finally getting to the end of the haul and this is basically the last thing that I picked up and it's this kind and it's just this pair of burgundy tights now I know burgundy is kind of like a fall color um, but I still really love burgundy and I feel like I never really got out of that burgundy phase because fall in Canada is just so short so I am still in that burgundy phase I do love this pair of tights and I think that it is something that can look really hipster but it's something that looks classy as well these tights have polka dots over them and this, these tights have polka dots over them and I think they would look super cute if I wear this with a pair of high-waisted socks or something like that and oh my god and like a really cute skirt and I don't know I feel like this is like the perfect Tumblr inspired kind of outfit with these ties so and they were on sale for five dollars which is amazing because usually they're like 12 bucks which is too overpriced for me for a pair of ties so that basically sums up my haul today and if you guys want to see more videos like this please hit the subscribe button right now and check back to so if you guys want to see more videos like this, please hit the subscribe button right now so that you can go on this shopping journey with me and see what I bought and I don't know, see how shopaholic I am. Check back on that shopaholic girl. So that is all for what I bought today and thank you so much for sitting through here with me if you made it this far and please hit that like button if you enjoyed this video and until next time, bye! And before I go, happy spring!